Hi everyone and welcome to my vlog. So let me introduce myself. I'm Lizette and C. Corpus, grade 11 STEM. And for my topic for this video is all about communication breakdown. And the question is, why there is a communication breakdown? So keep watching! This video is for academic purposes only. What is communication and what is communication breakdown? Communication is a process of exchanging thoughts, ideas, and opinions in order to connect other people. Communication breakdown is defined as a failure to exchange information resulting in a lack of communication. We have four barriers of communication. The physical or the physiological barriers, psychological barriers, cultural barriers, and the linguistic barriers. Let me explain these barriers. Physiological barriers are the natural or environmental conditions that act as a barrier in communication in sending the message from the sender to receiver. Example of this barrier is talking too loud, barking of dogs, and even karaoke in the neighborhood like this. Psychological barriers It's called as mental barriers. This refers to social and personal issues of a speaker towards communicating with others. Example of these barriers is shyness, lack of confidence, or even trauma. Cultural barriers pertain to communication problems encountered by people regarding their values, belief, and tradition in conflict with others. We have different culture, different tradition, different costume, and even different belief. This may cause communication breakdown. Linguistic barrier pertain conflict with regard to language and word meaning because words carry denotative and connotative meanings. They can sometimes cause confusion and misunderstanding. Example of this is different language, accent, dialect. It may be misunderstood by everyone. Those are the four barriers of communication. We have also three classified as noise, the external, internal, and the semantic. Let me explain these noises. External noise are the sight, sound, and other stimuli that draw people's attention away from the intended meaning. Internal noise are the thoughts and feelings that interfere with meaning. Semantic noise are the alternate meaning aroused by the speaker's symbols. And that's the tree classified as noise. To avoid communication breakdown, we must focus and pay attention to the speaker. That's it. Hope you like it. Thanks for watching. 